So this question is a diagram question. The visual input we're provided with here is an x f of x table, where basically each of these rows represents an ordered pair because f of x and y are always the same thing. So I'm just going to write these out as ordered pairs. The question says, for the linear function f, the table shows three values of x and their corresponding values of f of x. Which equation defines f? All right, so in, uh, anytime we're trying to find an equation that defines a linear function, we are going to think of it from a y equals mx plus b point of view, which is our slope-intercept form of, a, of an equation. I can write it as f of x equals mx plus b to put it in function form, where m represents the slope and b represents the y intercept. So we're actually provided with the y-intercept here. We have 0, 13. So we know that 13 should be our y-intercept. And what do we know? All of the options have that. So that's not going to be helpful in us crossing anything out. Um, what else can we do? We can figure out the slope, right? So let's figure out what the slope is. The easiest way to figure out the slope without having a graph actually drawn for us is to use the slope equation, which is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And we can just choose whatever we want for those for those values. So for instance, I'm going to say, what do I want to do? I'm going to say that 0 is x1, and 13 is y1, and 10 is x2, and 9 is y2. So that turns into a 9 minus 13 for my numerator, and a 10 minus 0 for my denominator. 9 minus 13 is negative 4. 10 minus 0 is 10. Uh, negative 4 divided by 10 could be simplified or reduced to negative 2 over 5. So my slope should be equal to negative 2 fifths. The answer that has a negative 2 fifths as a slope is choice D.